Hello guys, today I want to show you a new feature in Laravel minor version which was released roughly a month ago in Laravel 10.35 before the Christmas break which is Blade Use Directive by Simon Hamp which got quite a lot of positive reactions from the community so 22 likes is quite a lot because apparently many people had that problem of using for example enums. Enums is probably the best case scenario to showcase that and if you wanted to use that enum class inside Blade somewhere, you had to use something like this or provide the full path each time. Let me demonstrate. So this is the code of our own Laravel daily website. And in one of the Blade files, we have this. For each post content format cases, we just build a dropdown of values. But what if you don't want to provide the full app enums here? As an option, you can do something like this on top. That's before Laravel 10.35. This has been since the beginning of Blade almost. You can use any class, provide an alias, and then you don't need to specify the full path. You can just do something like this. And by the way, this enum class is very simple, just post content format. So now in 10.35, you can achieve the same thing, but in a bit shorter way. Instead of doing PHP, you can do a shorter use, and then two parameters. This as a string like this and alias as a string like this. And then you don't need to specify PHP and, and PHP here is just one line instead of three lines. The author Simon said on GitHub that unfortunately ID support won't be there initially. So it doesn't help with ID auto-completion or anything like that, but it's just a one-liner instead of three lines. And Laravel is full of such one-liners or shorter options of writing code, and they release more minor features like this one in minor Laravel versions, like 10.35 in this case. I will shoot more videos about new features as they are released, like this one, so subscribe to the channel to get daily videos from Monday to Friday, and see you guys in other videos.